Okay, we're gonna go set five crab pots out. Um, as you can see, oh, not really, you can see. I changed the hubs to a HT stud pattern so I can run a 13 inch tire. So I get rid of those four wheel drive tires because um, I was having to launch the car too far into the water every time I want to go fishing. So we'll try this at the boat ramp. Hopefully it fixes the issue. Hopefully we get some crabs. Here we go again. Up. So hopefully a magpie goose can fit in here. <laughs> Tide is still coming in, I can't believe that. Got that in there. Or well, most people with their um, geese frames, they just chuck them in the bin. So we'll leave them out in the scrub for everything else to eat. So we'll try something different. I'll put a bit of chicken in there too to cover all bases. Bait in there for a little. Oh, there's the current fights me. Right here looks pretty good. Tangled. Get the rope out. Now, we might not even get anything yet. The water temp is that hot, so generally when the water's hot, the crabs sort of turn off.
current is still coming in. Turn these off until I'm putting it in. That's the second pot in. Spin around and go down, put the last three in. two pots out I don't know if you will see I've never crabbed this creek before always wanted to it's right near my creek still the mullet Lightning over there. First crab pot. I hope this storm doesn't get me. The mozzies are getting me. Oh. Full of leaves. Full of shit. All just crap stuff. Alright, let's quickly get these things emptied and get going. Sure you poured out of here. I found my crab float, at least. Yeah, not a good sign though. That's about 25 meters from where I put it. Big tides. Right, chit chat. We got a keeper. One keeper.
No, the holes, but it's rusty. Double check on the lie detector. So, definitely in. Stick it over now. <laughs> Lucky I'm checking them today, I'll never find these things. Crabs. There's heaps of crabs actually. Oh, look at that. Well, how many have we got? One, two, three, four, five. Five crabs. <laughs> That's why I got swept away in the current. Um, how many legal ones out of that many? Got a real big one in there. That's a definite. Gotta hurry up though. <laughs> Look at that though. Yeah, he's definitely legal. All right, those two go straight into the bucket. Into the top of them.
Alright. Alright. Not as slow as he. Rusty, but he'll be good crab next year. And what do we get? Four keepers in one grab pot. That's not bad. So we're up to five. We're gonna get five more and I'm limited. And I've still got two traps to go. This tree probably saved this pot from getting washed down and snagged. I probably haven't got any water on the lens. It's a bit hard, it's been raining, it's hot, humid, it's first thing in the morning. That's two for sure. Catfish, one, two, and two undersizes. The humidity. I like this. It'd be good if it was just legal so I don't have the Not eating catfish in there. Ooh. That's a legal crab. So they made three on that pot. So, um, Again, I'm sorry if the um, lens keeps fogging up. We are in the tropics and this everything is wet. Crabs. Uh, uh. We got <laughs> We're limited out, that's for sure. Yeah, 
Need to get that little one out somehow. How am I going to get it out? We're getting nailed. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, I'm going to get that little Jenny out. It's legal, but. Fuck, it's got to be a prick to get it out, too. Doing it. Just trying not to fall in. Nah, it's doing. Um, this is salt water. As you see, I'm still way out the front. We're gonna get some salt water. Cooking these crabs. I had some salt water already in here, but it's... Maggie's. And then keeping high out of the don't bite your friggin' hand, it'll rip you off the boat. That's enough. Might as well do it while you're out in the ocean. Uh, uh, turned out to be a good morning. A bit worried about the storms this morning. All right, let's get in. <laughs> 